social update UG. Pro begins. Pro begins after. After two planes collide mid-air in Kenya. Uh, two planes have collided mid-air in Kenya. How funny can that be? Or how tragic can that be? Uh, that photo you're seeing there, that, those are security officers at Nairobi National Park crash scene where a Cessna plane run by 90 Boniface Bogita National Media Group 9's flying school crashed after it collided with Safari Link plane on March 5th, 2024. Uh, the mid-air incident between the local carrier Safari Link and the 99 flying training school occurred Tuesday morning, Kenya authorities said. Kenya Civil Aviation Authority experts were on Tuesday pulling all stops to unravel the cause of the mid-air collision of two airplanes near Wilson Airport. A student pilot and instructor died when their aircraft collided with a passenger plane over the Kenyan capital Nairobi, police said. The mid-air incident between local carrier Safari Link and the 99 flying training school occurred on Tuesday morning, Kenyan authorities said. Uh -huh. Nairobi Pro police Adamson Bull Bangay confirmed the deaths to AFP via text message without providing further details. An earlier police report seen by this reporter said the passenger plane requested to turn back for landing after the collision. Safari Link said in a statement that the plane with 44 people on board was heading for Diani along the Kenyan coast when it experienced a loud bang soon after the takeoff. All passengers and crew on board the aircraft were unharmed in the accident, it said. The relevant agencies have been notified and together with Safari Link Aviation are investigating, it said. 99 Flying School confirmed an incident this morning in a phone call with AFP but declined to give more information. The training school caters for private, commercial and airline sectors, according to its website. The Kenya Civil Aviation Authority said the investigations had started to establish the cause of the accident. Safari Link flies to 18 destinations in Kenya, neighboring Tanzania, and forest magnate Zanzibar, according to its website. Uh, please don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell button. Peace.